Hello? Is your Apple Mac Mini M1 constantly showing the wrong date and time after booting up? This is likely due to a drained coin cell battery that needs to be replaced. Even though the Mac Mini doesn't have a main battery for portable use, it does have a small coin cell battery that maintains the correct date and time when unplugged from power. Over time, this coin cell battery can drain and cause issues like an incorrect system clock that resets every time you unplug or restart your Mac Mini M1. Don't worry, replacing this battery is a straightforward process. In this video, I'll show you step-by-step step how to access and safely replace the coin cell battery inside your M1 Mac Mini. You'll need just a few basic tools. Let's go. Open up your Apple Mac Mini M1. You may use on old credit card to remove the black cover. This is easy to remove. Once the back cover is removed, remove all the six screws. Then don't lift yet the cover holding the Wi-Fi antenna. You need to remove another screw. Then after that, use a plastic tool to remove the connector from the motherboard. Then you can now lift the whole cover. You can easily see where the coin cell battery is installed. You can use your finger and a small tool to remove the battery. Now here is the battery I will install. It is a Max LCR 1632 3 volts battery. This is a replacement. The original battery, as you can see here, is the BR1632A 3 volts battery made by Panasonic. There is a difference between a BR and a CR coin cell battery. You can look it up on the internet for additional information. The battery can easily be installed. With little effort, you can insert the new battery. All done. Don't forget to put back the inside cover and the black cover. Now we will see if this replacement battery will work. As you can see from the image that the date and time is always April 1st at 12 a.m. I will log in first to my Apple Mac Mini M1 and let it automatically get the correct date and time from the NTP server, which is on the internet. Then I will shut down my computer and remove the power. I waited at least five minutes before I reconnected my Apple Mac Mini M1 to the power. As you can now see, the correct date and time is saved. Follow along step by step, and your Mini will keep perfect time again even after power cycles. Question, can you still use your Apple Mac Mini M1 if you removed the coin cell battery? Answer, definitely yes. Even if you remove the coin cell battery, you can still boot up the Apple Mac Mini M1 and be able to use it as normal. If your Apple Mac Mini M1 is connected to the internet, and settings are set to automatically update the date and time, it will get the correct date and time from an NTP server. See additional Apple support docs on how to set automatically the date and time on Apple Mac Mini M1 Mac OS. Question, why replace the battery if the Apple Mac Mini M1 will still work even if there is no coin cell battery installed inside? Answer, to have the correct date and time always, even if you shut down and boot up again your Apple Mac Mini M1. You don't need to set it every time you boot the computer up, that is, if you are not connected to the internet. Question, can you use an alternative battery? Answer, 
In my experience, my Apple Mac Mini M1 is still fine and running as normal with a replacement battery, but ideally use the BR1632A battery type, since this is what is installed originally in the Apple Mac Mini M1. Decide carefully if this is something you would like to do. Fix that annoying incorrect date and time issue on your M1 Mac Mini by giving it a fresh coin cell battery. Thank you very much for watching this video. Hopefully, it helps you replace your Apple Mac Mini M1 coin cell battery.